Welcome to Peaceful Streaming. So I am um, back to Stardew Valley. It's acting a little weird, so hopefully it's going to be okay. Um, and the sound, at least for me, is really loud. At least the music sound. So I'm turning stuff down a little. Hopefully that's not down too low. So, um, oh, let me just... Let's see. Looks like we're getting a delivery. What else is new? Um, okay. So um, I haven't played for a long time, um, mainly because uh, what happened was there was a lot of house flipper stuff before Christmas and then since and stuff. So um, that's why I've been doing a lot of, and honestly, of course, I can't really remember where I am in the game, but... Guess we'll see. Um, so it's going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the Egg Festival. The event will take place in Pelican Town starting between 9 and 2. Don't be late. Okay, good. So then um, I can buy my strawberry seeds. Fortune Teller says, spirits are somewhat annoyed today. Luck will not be on your side. Okay, well, I don't, don't think I was planning to go to the mines anyway. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the lover spirit that much I can tell. Now, the reason it says the lover spirit is because I have this mod called Pacifist Valley where the uh, monsters all like hug you. Um, so uh, if you can cuddle 10 slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventurers guild. Be careful, Marlin. And maybe it's just my, because I'm listening. I've got kind of a weird sound set up, but. It's really still sounds loud to me. So I'm going to. It's weird that it doesn't really. How much it takes to actually get the sound down. Oh, we've got something else. Dear Peaceful, tomorrow we're holding the egg. Wait, didn't I just hear get this? Oh, no, that was okay. Sorry. That was on the TV. Okay. Tomorrow we're holding the Egg Festival in the town square. You should arrive between nine and two. If you'd like to attend, you wouldn't want to miss the annual egg hunt, Mayor Lewis. Now, I don't do the egg hunt just because I'm not dexterous enough to to actually like even get close to winning. So I just watch Abigail win as usual. Um. Wow, I guess it has been a while. I can't even remember how to do stuff. Okay, so time to water. Um, so I have 2,800. So that is plenty of money for the strawberry seeds. Probably should think about planning some more... Um, turnip seeds or something. Oh, parsnip, parsnip, sorry. It's been, it has been a while. Sounds like my cat's licking its paw or something. Am I doing water-wise? I'm almost out. What are you doing? You're licking your paw, I knew it. That's the licking your paw sound. Okay. Okay, I think I did that one. Okay, so I think we're all watered. Um, I'm going to sell these parsnips. Uh, I think I'll hold on to the potato because... Um, why am I, so I guess I was making copper bars last time. Journal updated. Was that my first thing I smelted? Um, I don't know. Okay. That's weird. Um, I do not remember what that was. Okay. So I, since I still have enough to make another one, I'm going to throw that in there. Put all this in the bin and put my potato away. Now, if I recall, 
I don't think I yet, I didn't get anything, not even the spring foraging bundle. Really? Wait a minute. So I have that, that. Oh, right. I kept having trouble finding, of all things, a dandelion. Like, who would think a dandelion would be so hard to find? Um, but it has been. It's very strange. Like, the thing that you usually don't want, but seem to end up with anyway. And now I can't find it. So, um, so I'm going to go... <laughs> Uh, oh, there it is. <clears throat> I'm going to go buy some turnips. I mean, turnip seeds. I don't want a lost book. Thank you. Um, and then I'll go to the community center. Pick this up too. Okay. Oh, and here's a, um, Horseradish. I'm leek. <laughs> oh my god, my brain is like. Funny, I have played so many more hours of Stardew Valley than House Flipper, yet my brain has just been, I guess, taken over. Okay, so parsnip seeds. Okay, that's enough. Yeah, especially because I'm going to buy the strawberry seeds tomorrow. Oh my God, it's freezing in here. I just turned the little heater off. How can it be so cold? It's for, for our area, it's cold. Although we came from the East Coast. So every time we say like 40 degrees is cold, we kind of laugh at ourselves. Actually, we really laugh at ourselves. But um, yeah, it's... It's been chilly. Went down, uh, it'd been okay. And then it, last night it went down to like 40 degrees by 11, 11 p.m. So we knew today was going to be cold. Although it was supposed to go up to 60. Did not happen, I promise you. Although I have not looked at any weather report, I can guarantee it did not go up to 60. Uh, I can't remember if this is the foraging room or not. Yes, okay. Um, I know I don't actually have to put them in their slots, I don't think, but I always do anyway. Okay, so now I got, um, I'm going to get the seeds. So I can plant some spring seeds also. And then I can't really do much right now with that. I, uh, I'll be, oh, now I'll be able to get, do the crops thing though. So that was a big reason to do this. Excuse me. I'm just going to be <clears throat> drinking my ginger beer too. <coughs> kind of makes my, <coughs> my throat sore. This is a really strong ginger beer. Okay. So um, I don't have anything right now for this, but I actually may have all of those. <laughs> Okay, guys, I hope I made you happy. Um, let's see what time is it? 1230. Um, how much room do I have? Oh, my God. Uh, okay, so I think I'm going to go to the beach and see if there are any shells because, you know, I could always use the money. I actually haven't noticed also if anyone's birthdays are coming up. Probably should pay attention to that. I get so hyper focused on just becoming friends with my future spouse that a lot of times I forget this stuff. Last shards. Did I bring those to Gunther yet? Nope. Okay. So I'll do that. I'm sorry. It's I'm going I've got to turn this down again because this is just I don't know what's going on. It's really strange. Ambient sounds. 
Okay, I'll just turn on the ambient sounds. Footstep volume, I think I can turn down. That was, it's just weird. I don't know if maybe my ears are more sensitive today. So there are no shells. Okay, there's one coral. Wow. That's kind of disappointing. Um, okay, so I'll go drop this off with Gunther. It's already two. I don't know, maybe the uh, spirits uh, affect that or something. I'm not sure. I, I'm pretty sure there do, is some effect on foraging. So. Do I have a... Oh, I'm going to have to put on my jacket. Hang on one sec. I'm freezing. I'll be right back. And I turned up the heat all the way to 65. We try to conserve. Um, generally, it's possible. Now I'm just freezing. Okay, Gunther. I tend I put the pretty stuff in the middle and up top, and not so pretty stuff put in the bottom one. Okay, well he didn't have anything for me. That's the way it goes. It's Friday though. I do have a couple daffodils. And if anyone who has a birthday is, a lot of people gather in the, in the pub for Friday night. So it might be worth, nope. Haley's is coming up, could not care less. Pam's is coming up on the 18th. She has some good recipes, so it's actually worth making friends with her. Um, God, I can't remember. She likes something weird, doesn't she? Like, she likes parsnips or something. Um, yeah, I think she does. Oh, I got sugar all over my mouth. We got donuts. We should not have, but... There's a place that has really good donuts and I love cr French crawlers. So, um, okay. So let's see. I, let's, I guess let's plant the parsnip seeds. I think I should be able to plant everything, right? Uh, I think I could probably hoe stuff too. Hopefully I won't hoe anything up. That does happen sometimes. Oh, I guess we did get a delivery. I don't think it's for me though. Oh, wait a minute. I was going to leave the space behind the scarecrow because that's so difficult to um, to take care of. Okay. Um... Okay, so there are the parsnips. I'm trying to remember. Um, I do. I think I do want to have. Did I not put fertilizer on any of these? What? Wait. Seriously? Do I not? Am I not able to make fertilizer? Where is it? There it is. Okay. Do I not have any sap? That's weird. Normally I'm really good about that. Uh, I have sap, so I do not know what's going on. That's the problem with waiting so long to play games. I just don't remember what's going on. Okay. Uh, That's weird. That's really strange. I can't fertilize it afterward, right? Can I? Huh. 
Why did I think I couldn't? Probably because I never tried. Probably because I never had to because I always fertilize. So, oops, I'm all out. I, that is too much clicking for my arm because must be added before planting. Okay, so I was right, sadly. Um, that's weird. Maybe it lets you still do it on the day of planting. Um, yeah, my arm is in a lot of pain and I'm supposed to get stuff. I'm supposed to get it taken care of Friday. So I was all concerned because normally they, um, they contact me or at least normally during the pandemic, they contact me and say, Hey, before you, you can't come to the surgery center unless you've had a negative COVID test within three days of your appointment. So I was like, that's weird. No one has contacted me. And it's because their policy is now, if you're vaccinated, then you don't have to have. So you either have to be vaccinated or have a negative COVID test. And since they had my records and knew that I had been vaccinated, then they were obviously not worrying about contacting me, but I was like, I cannot miss this appointment. I need to get this done. I'm in so much pain. Um, it's a real drag. How many do I have left? Eight. Okay. But I also want to have, oh shoot. And I have to water these. Okay. Come on. I am so clumsy with this. So the main thing with the strawberry bushes is um, once they, they're one of those plants that once they um, are fully grown, then they keep producing, you know, the, it's not something, it's not like, what's something I'm thinking of, like parsnips, you take, you um, take them out of the soil and that's it, they're gone. This is one of those that, um, that um just keeps keeps producing like you know grapes and whatever else all that stuff what's another one i can't remember cranberries my brain isn't really responding oh come on okay so that's so i have what like eight spaces that's just enough and I'll try to get some of these watered. I always wonder if, does it make any difference if I water it at night or am I just wasting, am I just wasting my time? Um, I have no idea. It seems like in the past, I thought I had seen somewhere that they're just, when it's this late, there's no point. Um, and honestly, I'm gonna go with that. Uh, let's see, put that back, put that back, sell this and put this other stuff in here. I don't really need this, but, um, until I go in the mines, but I haven't made my, I usually make a chest that is near the exit, the farm exit. It has this mining stuff and fishing stuff and I haven't made it yet. So, oh, wow. 270. Ugh. Didn't level up in anything. Okay. Wait a minute. What did I just do? <gasps> what did I I moved everything. Oh my God. How did I do that? I moved everything to the next row. Shoot. Okay. Weather. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Rats. It doesn't matter what the fortune teller says. Spirits are very happy today. Okay, great. Um, oh man, I don't know how to, how to send it back to how it was. Rats. I mean, not that that took a lot of time, but 
I didn't realize I could do that. I think I need to look that up because that's okay. Good. I have a lot of turnips, and none of them have were fertilized apparently. So that's kind of a drag. Yes, cat. I'm not gonna forget your uh, your water. Um, okay, so I'm going to put mm, a lot of these in here because, let's see, I need a gold one for the, um, whatever, a superior crop or whatever. Um, that's about all I need for the regular ones, and then I'll sell the rest of them. Okay. Water is such a pretty color. Now, I, I think uh, I'm almost 100% sure that when you leave the, um, the egg festival, it's nighttime. So I need to do what I can to prepare everything. So that I can just go like pop the seeds in. <laughs> oh, okay. And now I, I've told the cat I wasn't going to forget his water, so I should do it before I do forget it. There you go. The egg festival has been, oh my God. Oh, it's 9 a.m. I thought it started at two. Okay, um, I guess I better, let's see. Um, wait a minute. I'm not gonna get that many, but. Uh, let's see, I'll make sure it's all done over here. Okay, um, okay, I think I got them all. Okay, now we're off. Ugh. Okay, so let's buy the strawberry seeds. Hey, Shane. Wow, you're not telling me to get lost. You're saying, why are you talking to me? Our hens have been working overtime to prepare for this festival. They deserve the best tonight. Bowls full of sweet yellow corn. Okay, great. Okay, um, they're only 100 each. I always... um. I don't really know because there's they take a long time how long do these take they take eight days to mature and it's already the uh what's the date oh god i forget it's like the 15th or something so they're not going to have much time so i feel, i don't want to really want to waste things want to waste my money on the other hand easy come easy go Okay, there we go, 18. Okay, hi. No one really talks to me. I just come for the deviled eggs. Don't we all, Linus, don't we all? Pa Pam says, I put something nice in the punch. Great, Pam. 
Um, Robin says, spring is a busy time of year, so it's nice to have a day off to catch up with friends. Caroline says, Abby's always loved the egg hunt ever since she was a tiny girl. It's probably because she wins every single year. Marlon says, even with my bad leg, I never miss a town festival. Really? Is that true? Oh. Demetria says, egg, what a strange thing to eat. Um, yeah, I, I guess it's all on how you look at it. Um, Jody says, Vincent loves this festival. It's a joy to see him so happy. Emily says, I've been up since dawn coloring eggs. It's always my favorite part of the season. Um, and Maru says, I always look forward to these gatherings. It makes the valley feel like a real community. Penny says, the children have been looking forward to this festival for weeks. Yeah, they're like all hopped up on sugar or something. Jazz says, I hope I can find some eggs before Vincent takes them all. Vincent says, when does the egg hunt start? I'm so excited. I could not tell. Leah says, mm, this fruit punch is unusually good. And my future husband says, taking breaks from work can make you more productive in the long run. Yes, it can. Um... Marnie says, welcome to the Egg Festival. Compliments of my wonderful brood of hens. That's what I heard. George says, what's everyone so happy about? Hmm. Eggs. Why eggs? Evelyn says, this festival has been a tradition for as long as I can remember. Tradition connects us with both the past and the future. It's comforting. I have absolutely no comment about that. Um, Sebastian says, we used to do a rotten egg toss. Mayor Lewis put an end to that pretty quick. Yeah, I would think so. Um, and Abigail says, searching for eggs is like going on a treasure hunt. Uh-huh. And you always win. Sam says, sniff of my nose allergies. Ugh, I'm right there with you, bub. Totally. Harvey says, eggs definitely have a place in the well-balanced diet. This is why I don't marry Harvey anymore. I mean, he's just like so... He's just got a one-track mind. Alex says, I try to eat at least three eggs a day. Okay. Haley says, this festival is all right, but what I'm really looking forward to is the flower dance. Uh-huh. That's never fun the first year because everyone is already, all of your, your future spouses, all your potential future spouses are paired up with someone and they really don't have enough interest in you usually. Willie says, sometimes I'll hide an egg too well. No one finds it well until summer rolls around. Then the hot air starts to bring out the rotten smell. Um, yeah, so it's like it, it's like being back in middle school and being rejected for dancing. Like you keep asking them and they're all like, nah, thanks. Or, oh, there's someone else I want to ask. And like you're like, okay, never mind. Okay, so... Mary Lewis says, do you think everyone's ready for the egg hunt yet? Yes, let's start. Sure. Mary Lewis says, it's time for the highlight of today's festivities. The annual spring egg hunt. Oh, my nose is running. Calm down, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most. Eggs and take home the exclusive prize. Why well, didn't talk to you up here? Not that he's that interesting to talk to. Now, is everyone ready? Sure. Let the egg hunt begin. So I guess I'll look just to... Wow, I'm like not seeing any. Oh, wait a minute. There's one and I can't get to it. There's another one. Um, and there's one I can't get to. I guess I'm not supposed to. Um, there's one. I'm trying to just go to the areas where no one else is. Um, there's one. So I'm not going to make a terrible showing. Where is everyone else? Oh, they blocked that one off. How much time do I have? I can get one more. <laughs> yep. There we go. 
I'm so sorry for the sniffing. I'm just totally congested. Mary Lewis says, wow, look at all those eggs. Now, if only I could get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, we'd have the cleanest town this side of the Gem Sea. Chuckle. And now the winner of this year's egg hunt, Abigail. Abigail. Yep. It always is Abigail. Wait a minute. She's older. Shouldn't she let the little kids win? Here's your prize, Abigail. Enjoy. That's okay, because I always win the fall Grange thing. Mary Lewis says, well, that's it for this year's Egg Festival. Thanks for coming, everyone. I still didn't talk to Pierre, but like I said, no, no big loss, really. He usually just like starts pitching something to you that he sells in his store, so, or complains. My, I have so, so much fun beating Pierre at the Fall Grange. It's just one of my joys in life. Now, again, I'm not sure. I mean, does this actually make a difference that I'm watering them now? Is it enough time? Is it just useless? I do not know. But uh, until I actually figure that out, better safe than sorry, I probably should figure that out. I guess I'll be able to find out like if, did I get all of them? Kind of hard to tell. Um, I guess if I come out and they look like they've sprouted a little, then that probably tells me, but wait a minute, there was a crow flying overhead. I have two scarecrows. I hope that's sufficient. Okay, so I made a little money for my turnips. Nothing to write home about. Day 14. So I think you usually get like two harvests out of the strawberries. Weather report. Please tell me it's going to rain tomorrow. It's going to be a beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Okay. Fortune teller says, welcome to Wellwick's Oracle, blah, blah, blah. Spirits are in good humor today. I think you'll have a little extra luck. I don't know what I'm going to do. Queen of Sauce. Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouth-watering recipe for my secret cookbook. This week's dish, coleslaw, envisioning bland mounds of limp cabbage. You're not alone, but a great coleslaw can be so much more. Make sure you have juicy, fresh cabbage for this one. Toss with a little vinegar and mayonnaise and you're all set. Ah, that's crisp. You learn how to cook coleslaw. Um... Is that a spring thing, the cabbage? I guess it is. Uh, looks like it was a good thing I did water them because they sprouted. I mean, of course, I'm not 100% sure that that actually was the reason because I, I watered these and they did not sprout. So I don't know. Okay. There's my cat licking its paw again. Oh, I keep, I gotta have to put this cushion under my arm. Oh my God, it's dark outside and our curtains are open. That always freaks me out. It's like, just to me, it's, People can, well, because there's so many people that um, drive by that it's like, it's like we're, if it's dark out there, it's light in here, then it feels like you're so exposed. Plus buses go by. <laughs> Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. I had a um, 8 a.m. doctor's appointment this morning. So I am no longer used to getting up that early.
I used to leave the house before the pandemic. I'd leave the house at like 10 past seven. And um, so I actually had to leave the house at 7.15 today. So yeah, it was, um, oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. What is that? Oh yeah, that's my seasonal plant. Okay, so two more. And then we're done. My seasonal plan, I will put here. It's not doing a lot. Is that supposed, is that an, that's not an indoor plant, huh? I hope it's gonna blossom. Ow, that's not actually helping my arm. Sometimes it helps to prop it up on a pillow. I don't think it's really. Ugh. So uh, let's see, what do I have? Um, I probably should make, I should make two chests. One for all my mine stuff. And then one for, I put all the seeds and fertilizer in that one. Um, okay, so you go back there. <laughs> Um, I'm going to put this in the fishing slash mining chest. Okay. So I put the fishing slash mining chest over here. Huh. Okay, there we go. And then the seeds and fertilizer one. Huh. Uh, let's see. I don't want it to interfere with the path, but I can always move it, I suppose. Oh, excuse me. I'm so sorry. Um, okay, so I'm just going to go wandering. See what's up. See what's up down south. I should probably actually be cutting this, shouldn't I? I actually, what I need to do is start thinking about um, building a barn. Oh, there's a, uh, whatchamacallit, horseradish, I think. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of things to um, chop down and stuff here. Yeah, so maybe I'll clean this stuff up. Did I, I don't have the, uh, I don't have what I need. Oh God, sprinkler. Well, I can't use sprinklers for all, but 48 wood, 46 wood and two copper bar. So actually I could tap, um, I could create a tapper. What do I want to tap? I guess the maple tree, probably. Let's just kill the little ones before they get out of control. Um, okay, so I think I'm gonna create a tapper and start with the maple syrup. Oh, excuse me, I am so sorry. But then Friday, I have to get at the sur to the surgery center at 7.30, so that's, even gonna be even worse. But it'll be worth it because hopefully at the most a day or two afterward later, I will not have this pain anymore. I really hope so. Where's my uh, energy bars? They're there. I do know that they're called field snacks, but I mean, to me, they're like literally energy bars. So that's why I call them that.
Um, let's see. I would like to get this stuff cleaned up a little. I wonder, so that's, looks like that's sand too, isn't it? No, it's not sand. Huh, I wonder if I can plant anything here and use sprinklers. Well, I haven't really got anywhere with the sprinklers, so it probably isn't any point right now. Now what, what, oh, that's one of the logs. Okay, I thought it was like a gully of some kind. Okay. You're going down. Okay, so what was I gonna, I was gonna make a tapper. Okay, and there's the wiggly things. Wow, I do have a lot of cleaning up to do, don't I? Okay. Now I just have to remember, which are the maple trees? I actually know this. I think the maple trees are the ones that curve, the trunk curves, like the one, the one I'm right next to, I believe. And their leaves are a little wider apart, I think. I could be wrong. I definitely could be wrong. Um, so I need, I need the wood and what was the other thing? I'm drawing, oh, the, oh, I only have, okay, I have one copper bar there and then one here. I knew I had two. Okay. I thought I was, like, losing it. Okay, so, um, I hope I'm right. Actually, I know one, <laughs> know one way to find out. Um, I have so many of these trees. I'll cut down one and see what drops off of it. Maple seed. Okay, so I don't want it too far away. Let's put... Let's put it on this one. Oops. Oh, no, there it is. Okay. Okay. So, so that I'll be able to see this. I'm going to chop down the one below it because otherwise I will like just forget it's there. Okay, so I'm gonna put my stuff away and then I am going to end the day and end the stream because I am gonna start a the first of two house flipper streams. And if I'm yawning this much now, I shudder to think what I will be doing by the end of the second stream. Okay. Okay, I don't think I think I, any of my levels are going to go up. Nope. The spreading weeds have caused damage to your farm. Yeah, it's not going to be that bad. Um, anyway, so I just wanted to thank um, everyone who's been watching and everyone who's watching the VOD. And I will do another stream, Stardew Valley stream, pretty soon. Um, so that I don't forget everything again. Anyway, I hope you're doing well and taking care of yourself mentally and physically. And I will see you soon. Bye-bye.